All right, everybody, we got another reaction vid. And joining us, we have a special guest from Reddit, Sean Robbins. This week, we're going to be listening to the band Money and their song, Down Forever. Take it away, Tim. good oh it was you, really good you hear that be quiet and drive that bomb bomb da, 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 da. i was just like as soon as i heard that i was like this these are my guys right here because like if you read the description on their website they're like influenced by bands like deftone smashing pumpkins and far mm. and that was just uh they're they share members from a, this other band called curse the knife which is kind of similar like shoegazy alt rock 90s failure hum vibes like you were talking about um but yeah the whole that whole, that those four songs are very much like that kind of fuzzy heavy would not um uh it would fit perfectly with those other bands you, you yeah heard. that's that's great i mean the first thing i heard was was hum oh, yeah. hum and far and then the the then as they played more i'm like okay i hear the deftones i hear loathe who some say is a different ripped off but i think it's close yeah. um no that's what'd you think tim yeah it, it reminded me of i don't know if you heard that ep from last year from bleed it yeah. sounds like that you know what i'm talking about yeah that, that's, that's so good that's that made a- my top yeah. 10 last year that's how fucking good I, I thought that was 
But yeah, I mean, you, you nailed it right there with the helmet and the, all that stuff. It just, I think that like whole resurgence, like resurgence came back like real quick. Yeah. Yeah. No, that they was, know that how to, they know how to produce it too, which is like, that's kind of a, what makes it. Because if you try to do, if you try to do clean, too much of a clean production on that type of music, you start to sound a little too like Chevelle ish, yeah. polished, yeah. overproduced. You sound like basement. You sound like yeah. yes, yes, yep. yeah. You need a little bit of like a grunge, almost like almost like a fuzz to it, which they had. Like you can hear it in the guitar, you can hear it in the uh, yeah. in the bass. Um, no, that was I had never heard that before, and that's really really good. I really like that. I actually just ordered the I ordered a fucking shirt, and I bought it off Bandcamp. That yeah, bill you, was, my Bandcamp did, bill is going to be outrageous this month. You know what it sounds? It sounds like when a lot of bands go in when they go to mix, they like they take the kick and the snare and they replace it with something more popular, but it sounds like this, they took it right off the board and mm-hmm. just mixed it that way without any samples in it. Yeah. They were like, we want you to sound, you want, we wanted to hear like you're in the room with us. Yeah. In the show, in the basement show. And <laughs> we want you to, even though yeah. you're in control of the volume, we want you to be like, Oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. Everyone's playing a strat. Yeah. Yeah. A strat with a fuzz <laughs> <Yeah>. face. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, that was that was really good though. We definitely got to watch out for them because I really, really enjoyed that. I mean, you're right. I can definitely hear the Smashing Pumpkins influence, right? Which is that early proto grunge, like indie mm-hmm. stuff. Um, that's good shit. That's really good shit. Yeah, I was not expecting that because I I thought like last year around this time is when you started hearing a lot of that stuff, and I'm like, where is all this coming from? Because I would like put on like a channel and I on Apple Music of like just bands like this, and I'm like. This shit had to come out in 98 and you look and it's like 2021. You're like, wait, well, what? Like when, why is all this happening now? It's like, it's like new metal and this whole grungy alternative era just comes back at once. Yeah. It's just super strange. Uh, it's um, everything is going full circle again, right? Like you think about it, we're 20, 20 years out from new metal. So it makes sense that it comes out now. Uh, it, it makes sense that there's a resurgence now. However, it's now it's not a dirty secret anymore. Like it's yeah. not like hiding, you know, it's like, Oh, well, I'm a, I'm a new metal fan. And I, I, I call myself new metal core or new death core on purpose. So <laughs> All right. Good shit. Good shit. Sorry. Right, so thanks. Uh, Sean just apparently had to drop, <laughs> but <laughs> <laughs> thanks Sean for, for suggesting that uh, we'll put a link to the band's video and to, uh, to their band camp. So check them out, check them out on Spotify and tune in next Friday for another reaction vid. Thanks again, all. All right.